Hello everybody, this is a Video Game Chronicles Quickie. I'm here to talk about the sales figures to the NES Classic Edition because the NES Classic Edition sales figures actually came out and it was for the month of November. The NES Classic Edition sold 196,000 units. The problem I have with that is the fact that I don't believe that it was 196,000 units that got sold. I believe that less than 196,000 were sold. Because of the shortages Nintendo of America decided to do. Because if they wouldn't have given out crumbs or chunks of the NES Classic Edition in the stores those sales figures would have been a lot higher or it would have been actually precise to the 196,000 units that Nintendo of America said that they sold. I still don't believe that those are the actual sales figures because of the shortages that Nintendo decided to do on the NES Classic Edition. Nintendo of America, what they're doing right now is pathetic. Having shortages of the NES Classic Edition is the wrong thing to do and I would like to see Nintendo of America ship more units in the stores and to allow more people to get it online. Because that's the biggest problem right now. You can't get it online hardly for 60 bucks, which is the actual sales price to the NES Classic Edition right now. You can't do that. And the only thing that you can really get still is the Famicom Mini. Now I did a video, the last video that I did, I talked about the Famicom Mini outselling the NES Classic Edition. The NES Classic Edition got outsold by the Famicom Mini in November. Even if the 196,000 units was actually the truth, it still was outsold by the Famicom Mini. The Famicom Mini sold over 300,000 units. That's a lot more than the NES Classic Edition did. Nintendo Japan didn't make it as limited as what Nintendo of America did with the NES Classic Edition. Because I bet you, if we had Nintendo of Japan, if we were all living in Japan right now, the shortages of the NES Classic Edition never would happen. It would never come into play. What Nintendo of America is doing right now is pathetic. It needs to stop and they need to put out more NES Classic Editions so that way people can mostly get their hands on them. Now I know that Wet Movie 1 who did a video recently showed him getting the NES Classic Edition and his Best Buy only had 40 in stock. 40! And the only way you could get those 40 is if you were standing outside in the middle of the night to get a voucher. And this is what Best Buy did this week. They put out more NES Classic Editions on the 20th, because I believe that's the actual day Best Buy decided to release more NES Classic Editions to the public for 60 bucks. Now, if you weren't at Best Buy, you were out of luck. And GameStop did the same thing. However, GameStop's was much shorter. There wasn't really much in terms of GameStop. GameStop, not in every single store. The stores that did have them only provided three. That's right, three units in GameStop stores. Only three! Only three Nintendo put to GameStop stores, and that was pathetic. And that was on the 21st, I think, or the 22nd. 
of December. It's still pathetic the way Nintendo is handling the NES Classic Edition by not providing enough. Give me a break, Nintendo. The way you're handling the NES Classic Edition, you're giving it a bad name. Nintendo of Japan is not giving the Famicom Mini a bad name. They're outselling the NES Classic Edition. More Famicom Minis are being sold today than the NES Classic Edition. I'd like to see that change, Nintendo. Put out more NES Classic Editions than what you put out. You should have had more in GameStops, too. Rather than three units in almost every single GameStop. Not every single GameStop got any. I know my local store got only three. And I know another location got only three. This is not how the way to do it. Give me a break. You're going to do this with the Switch. You really are. How am I going to feel about that? I am not going to be happy when the Switch comes out. Because you're going to do the same thing with that. Now, I know that J. Johnny who set 79 put out a video saying that the Switch should be put out at least in the summer or in the holiday season. But the problem I have is with Nintendo. Nintendo has these shortages of their hardware. That is the reason why... I don't think it'd be a good idea to have in the summer or the holiday season. Because I know Nintendo is going to probably put out crumbs. They need to stop this. Yeah, and I am responding to your video, J. Donahue79, because I, I needed to. See, yours would you would have had the better idea if it wasn't for Nintendo doing only shortages of certain hardware. If it wasn't for Nintendo with their hardware, I would say yes. I would say yes, it would be a good idea. The reason why I'm saying that March is good over what you said is because of the way Nintendo handles things. Nintendo will, will probably not stop this. Nintendo needs to stop this. Needs to stop putting out shortages of their hardware it's getting pathetic every single time they put out a new system console whatever not i get sick and tired of it and you're probably going to feel bad when the switch comes out and and it's basically sold out but hopefully with the release in march Hopefully there'll be a lot more supply in the holiday season next year. It'll definitely be a lot better because Nintendo will learn not to put out shortages after that. They still do the shortages thing and I hate it. I really do. They did it with the Wii. I think they did it with the Wii U and they definitely did it with the Amiibos. I really hate it. And I'm sorry that this had turned out to be a rant, but I had to have my say with Nintendo. And this is also my response to Jay Donahue 79 as well. Because this is how I feel about Nintendo these days with their business practices. And for people that didn't get an NES Classic Edition on Christmas, I'm sorry. I'm sorry that you didn't get what you wanted because of Nintendo. That's all I really got to say about that. But I do wish every single person that is watching this a Merry Christmas. Because I am filming this on Christmas Eve. Peace out everybody. And Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Happy Gaming.